They are unable to judge their own output. They need somebody else to say, this will work or this won't. So if your ideas are good, that means you can be a leader. Is that clear now? Next thing, okay? Okay, alright. Number four, a willingness to take responsibility. I think this is the one of the keys. One of the keys of leadership. Taking responsibility. You take responsibility. That means you don't take it lightly. You take your responsibility very seriously. A person who displays okay, I'm sorry for all this mistakes I've made. Alright, who displays great interest and accountability in any given task as a strong trait of becoming a leader. Okay, so you must be willing to take responsibility. That shows you can be a leader. Is that okay, Jason? Yes. When you do you remember when I asked uh, I, mean, I asked uh, you to take part in the public speaking competition, you took that challenge, right? That is the characteristics of a leader. Can you understand now, Jason? Right? A person who is well. Okay. Number 10. Tenacity and perseverance. Tenacity means tenacity means strength. Right? You have strength. Okay, tenacity means you have strength. If I can explain that, you have strength. You have not only physical strength, you also have mental strength. That means whatever challenges, if people can do, I can do too. Uh, that's the attitude you have. That means you are a person who has tenacity. You are a person of strength. And you have perseverance. What is perseverance? You don't give up. Don't give up. You don't give up. Alright? Even though it's tough, it's difficult, it's tough, but you don't give up. Alright? When most people decide to quit, you choose to proceed, proceed and continue. This persistence, perseverance is persistence, alright? Persistence is the kind is the kind only a leader would possess. Not everybody can have that strength, can have that determination, can have that perseverance. When the going gets tough, the tough get going. I hope you understand that. Yeah? When the going gets tough, the tough get going. Meaning, when things become difficult, many people give up. But you don't give up. Alright? That's why the saying, when the going gets tough, the tough get going. Alright? When the going
You do good, uh, people will talk bad. You do bad, still fine, and you, of course, they will talk worse. Alright? So, but you know what you are doing, you keep doing. Alright? You must have mental toughness. That's why no one can lead without being criticized or without facing discouragement. A potential leader, mentally tough.
even you know when you step into an airplane as a cabin crew, you are junior, first day of work, all right? You are not a leader, you are not the A cabin crew, but you can start becoming a leader from day one. How? When your senior cabin crew gives you the briefing, you listen. Listening is a characteristic of a leader. Can all of you understand that? Is that okay, Sierra? So listening is a characteristic. Is that okay, Lisa? Yeah? Robin, okay? Austin, okay? Austin, tired? Come, Austin, come, come, focus, Austin. So even the first day, you can show your leadership qualities. Even though first day, you are a novice. Alright? You are starting your work. You are not a leader yet, but you can show leadership qualities. What is a leadership quality? At the lowest level is to listen. If you cannot listen to people, you cannot be a leader. Because then people will not listen to you. You want can understand now? Alright? So listening is very, very important. Alright? The attributes are required for success in whatever activity you work on. If you practice these qualities consistently, you will be able to establish your credentials as a leader. Okay, what are these qualities that you must have? Okay, establish a clear direction. You should be able to have a clear direction. That means you know how is the future going to be. You focus attention, you articulate values, you enlist or help others. All this, you have a clear direction to, to follow a clear 